In this symphony of what we call a human race, we all bring something beautiful uh, to it. My name is Obi Abuchi, and I am a CEO and founder of Core Leaders International. I was born here in the UK, went back to Nigeria when I was seven, and then came back to the UK when I was 17. I've got a mix of different cultures and I can connect with what it means to be human, what it means to be Nigerian, what it means to be from South London and put on a Cockney accent. Oh, For me, just being proud to be black is, is owning my identity and embracing all of the different elements and things and experiences that have shaped who I am. You're conscious of some of the, the stereotypes and, and they can breed lies in us about who we are, about what it is we have to offer. Anything that calls you to be more, to make a difference, to contribute, uh, to be your best self, I think that's true about you. Anything that says you're rubbish, you're nothing, you've got nothing to offer, that's a lie about you. I would say believe the truth that calls you to be more, to do more, to give more, to make a difference, and anything that goes against that um, isn't true about you. My wife's done an incredible job of putting um, an African twist on our home. When I think of my African heritage and connection, it's just these sorts of um, items that I connect with. This is a picture of me, uh, my wife and mom at our traditional wedding. But it's special for me because it's a visual I have of my mom before Alzheimer's and before just she uh, got sick. So her joy, her support has been incredible in my life. So these are two women that have uh, helped keep me grounded and, and my wife still does that. I didn't actually grow up with my dad, so it's quite a significant experience for me to not have one, two, but three boys who I get to be a father to. And when I think of my legacy, I, I don't think the first thing that comes to mind isn't the books I write or the business. It's the imprint on these boys' lives and the citizens that they become and the talents that they develop and the difference that they'll go on to make. I'm proud of these boys and looking forward to the incredible men that they'll become someday.